Brawl Stars has changed their ranked system, and I think it is way too easy to get Masters. So today, we're gonna put that to the test. I'm gonna be starting in Bronze with zero games played, zero elo, and I'm not getting off this chair until I hit Masters. And we're gonna time it to see how long it takes. Let's start. Of course, Bronze, Silver, and Gold was like a walk in the park, so let's do a montage instead. Put it in the net, Skibbity Rizzler! Put it in the net! Diamond already in only 40 minutes is kind of crazy. Now that we finally reached Diamond, the games are probably going to get a little bit harder, so I got a couple of friends to help me out. This also helps because I'm going to be getting a boost of ELO playing with them, so I'm definitely going to be able to get it faster. So now that I hit Diamond and I'm now in the second half, the more competitive aspect where there's drafting and it's a best of three instead of best of one in ranked, I'm now going to be playing with two teammates. I'm not playing with teammates to make it easier on myself, but if you play with teammates that are masters, then you get a higher boost of ELO. You get it because you're facing higher ranked opponents, so just because I hit Diamond doesn't mean I'm facing facing diamond i'm now facing masters and legendary players but this is gonna let me rank up way faster so this is how we're gonna do this for the video light work no reaction light work no reaction okay it's got a little kick oh okay so i'm now in my last game to hit mythic and we're actually losing 20 nothing to start off so pretty rough start for us we do have a really good team comp here so i do think we're gonna catch up they have a max speed running at us here so i'm just gonna put some spiders down try and hit some shots and keep my distance not gonna get close to that sandy and feed it a sandstorm because that is just gonna do way too much and get them free zone 100 percent I have my hypercharge now, so I'm probably going to try and make a play. Okay, whatever. I'll just put him in there since I was only 3 HP. We're going to have to spray him down and get this kill. There we go. Easy kill. And we have pretty good control of the zone right now. I'm going to heal up. My teammates, for some reason, don't really feel like standing in the zone, even when I have to heal. They would rather we just not get the zone than they stand in it, I guess. But we're doing a really good job, so I can't really complain. All right, they've given up. They're in their spawn, and that is going to be it for game one. Over to game two. And so far, same start. They're up 20 nothing again, but once we get our supers going, once we get some good control and position, it's pretty difficult for them to take it back. Leon's gonna be invis. Sandy's trying to sneak up, and they do have a max speed, but I just don't think they have enough to take the zone. I have some spiders in case I get too low. I don't even think I'm going to have to use them. And we're just going to stay as far away from the Sandy as possible. I have my hypercharge, so I'm going to use it. Oh, I missed. That's pretty bad. When I have my hypercharge with Charlie, I usually try and go for the brawler like Sandy. So she can't pierce my spiders. Instead, she's in the cocoon. And then the Leon and the Max have to waste ammo on it. But I did miss there. So try and go for pierce brawlers when you use your hypercharge with Charlie. But there we go. That is going to be game number two. Basically the exact same as game number one. And just like that, we should hit Mythic. There we go. Mythic in one hour and six minutes. This is absolutely insane how fast we're going. Mythic is where I expected to get my first loss. So it might be a little bit harder here. Let's see what's to come. I also have a cat on my team. I don't necessarily know why, but whatever, I guess. Maybe the cat is good. I also have a Byron healing me, so... Let's see exactly how much work we could do, but I feel like this is going to be a pretty easy game for us to win. Since, you know, they gave us Melody, which I still don't really understand, but it is what it is. I'm having a great time. Yeah, I still don't really understand why they gave me Melody, because I can just do infinite damage. But at the same time, you know, props to the other team. I, I respect their game giving me Melody. and I mean, we just did like, what, 60% there in 5 seconds? That was crazy. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. And there we go. That is going to be another game in the bag. This is just too easy for us. All right, so this game now I get Sandy. So I'm honestly just having a really good time playing all these really good brawlers. I'm gonna use my stun right there. Should be an easy goal. Get a sand super as well in 10 seconds. I mean, this is just too fun. Being able to play these actual good brawlers which I can't on ladder is actually a really good time. Victory! 
And there we go. Another goal in just 10 seconds. I mean, this is kind of crazy, to be honest. And I got some stuns and a super. I'm going to stun those players. Walk up the middle. Oh, and there was a Leon there. Smart little Leon, actually. Shelly was super going for it and there we go so the game was a little bit longer it was 37 seconds this time instead of whatever 30 seconds it was last but again another win another 358 elo and we are about to hit mythic 3 so here we go into our legendary game i can't believe we're already at this point but we are i'm gonna be playing poco because i just feel like walking in a straight line and not aiming really quick kill by our teammate over there and we are gonna score in nine seconds Again, we're just going to try and walk in a straight line and make some plays. I'm going to go down immediately, but again, our Shelly is just doing way too much, and we are going to win this game in 23 seconds. All right, going into game two, I think they're trying up a little bit of a different strategy, but I don't know if it's going to help them that much. We're going to get a nice little team wipe, and we're going to score a little bit longer than the last game, but in about 14 seconds. So we just need one more goal, and then we hit legendary. I do have my heal in a shot. Oh. Tara. Oh, that Tara just went kind of crazy, actually. I'll take them a little bit more serious here. Gonna try not to get pulled by this Tara here. Our Shelly's gonna go in, so we're gonna go for some heals. Gonna try and clip this wall. I do. And our Shelly's gonna easily score, and that is going to be a win. Took a little bit longer, but we should officially be legendary now. Let's see. And there we go. So it's been one minute, or sorry, not one minute, one minute, one hour and 23 minutes only and we are already in legendary now we are in the last rank before masters legendary and i just know something crazy is gonna happen here we're in legendary by far the most out of every other rank so i want to show you guys what went down in this rank because to be honest it was pretty crazy yo we're losing yo yo we almost just lost oh my god yo yo should be able to get another kill Ooh. not gonna get it but i will use my hypercharge and hit the gene gene down We are actually going to lose. Oh, maybe we're going to win. What is the Gene doing here? What is that Gene doing over here? Does he know he has all the gems? Does the Gene know he has all the gems? What is the Gene doing so far up the map? Dude, I don't even know what it is. It's even when you, like, actually lose, you don't even lose. A lot of missing. I am going to get two kills, but there was, to be honest, a lot of missing there. Okay, there we go. We should be able to get a ton of damage. It looks like the crow has given up, and there we go. Really quick game number one, only a minute long. And bang. That is going to be game right there. Again, about a minute long. What is this BB going to do exactly? Because she is not killing me. I don't think this BB knows what to do. There's nowhere this BB can go. I mean, this defense is just way too strong. So I'm just going to plant this right over here. And I don't think there's anything they can do about it. There we go. Perfect. And now they send the Larry on me. I don't really know what they expect to do. I don't think there's any way to stop a RT. And that should be it. So knockout, or sorry, not knockout. Hot zone is going to go really, really easily. Like really, really, really easily. So we went a tank Nita max comp because that's the fastest way to get a win. And we're just going to run in a straight line and see what we can do here. Because that's definitely going to help with just the time and being fast. Oh, okay. There we go. We do kill everyone. Koji is going to use his speed to score the goal. That's a real one right there. You know, he's doing his very best to get this done as fast as possible. Please. Please, please, please. Yes! You guys can probably hear there is some urgency in my voice. Like, I'm really trying to get this done as fast as possible. I want to do it before the two-hour mark. Nice shots over there by Koji, the Max, and good job by the Buster as well. He's going to use it, and I'm going to get my bear right off of it because he actually had a hypercharge speed. 
So yeah, it's gonna be too much for these guys to deal with. We're gonna get the goal. One minute win. I'm gonna get my super here, and we should be able to get damage and kill the bull, or at the very least get a lot of damage, but looks like we're doing both. So things are working out very nicely here. Gonna knock him back, please. Okay, I'm gonna go down finally, but we do 80% in like 30 seconds. Okay, so we should be able to go up and finish the game right now. We have our super, we have hypercharged buzz. The buzz didn't actually do anything, but we just have way too much damage. That's gonna be a one minute game number one. We're already on safe. Unfortunately, both of our tanks do go down, but we do get some good safe damage. And I can, I think, hold control for a little bit. I guess for a little bit more than a little bit. These guys can't kill me for some reason. Um, come on. Okay, really? It's gonna survive that low HP, and I'm gonna go down, so... Edgar does have jump. I do have super. Bull does have hypercharge. So we're gonna push this bull away. We want nothing to do with this bull. The bull is gonna super or their safe. I was gonna say our safe, but right there we end the game. We should get enough elo, or else I'm gonna get really mad. No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Go 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 go! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! We're at one hour and 56 minutes, and I'm 30 elo short. Oh my god okay so we're loading into what should be our final game right now we are at one hour and 58 minutes and 16 seconds so we are going to run in a straight line and try and win these games in 50 seconds of course we get bounty so it's probably not gonna happen but we're gonna do our very best nonetheless we are not juking any shots we are literally running in a straight line and not stopping unless we die or get a kill stop juking me stop it okay we get the kill Oh, did I double kill? Oh my god. Insane. Insane, insane. We just need to get a kill quick here. Please, please team. No. Okay, there we go. Now we're running up the map. We are doing the exact same thing we were last game, but I'm looking at my phone right now. We only have 10 more seconds to do it under two hours. So unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to get it done. And we die right there. And it's officially the two hour mark, which sucks. Koji's gonna go in and get, oh my god, a bunch of stars, but unfortunately, like I said, a little too little too late. We are gonna wrap this up right now, though. There we go. That is going to be time in two hours and 30 seconds. We have gone from zero elo all the way up to masters, the highest rank in the game.